Hey guys, it's iMaster, and today I'm going to be showing you how to easily customize your login screen, your Mac OS 10 login screen. I am on Snow Leopard, as you can see, but I'm almost 90, 100, almost 100% sure that this also works on Leopard. Um, so basically, the program is called Ravisant. There we go, and basically. It, it's drag and drop interface that lets you completely customize your login screen and yes it's free now first of all let me go ahead and play you this video that I took on my phone earlier just to prove to you that um, I am actually changing it and it's not some like default thing alright so I'll go ahead and play that for you now okay so as you can see my the screen is completely default just has um, Apple logo then my iMac William's iMac then William um, then the password in the field and just the default snow leopard um, background alright so as you can tell um, my login screen was completely normal just the default everything so, uh, let's go ahead and get started. In Ravisant, we can basically just, um, we can create a new document, and we can always have the option to save and open previous documents or login screens so that we don't have to start from scratch every time. Uh, the normal edit menu, you can, once you finish customizing, you can apply, and you can always restore to the default, which is good. Uh, more info gives you info about the selected uh, item over here and sync with desktop so far I have not figured out what it does I would like search the Ravisant help but there is no help um, but I'm sure it's nothing too important you, and then you can go into a full screen mode now um, I have my image here I'm going to replace the Apple logo with my avatar so I'll just drag that there and there you go and as you can see my avatar on my desktop is 885 by 885 even so Ravisant resizes it for me which is a really cool nice little feature then moving on to OS text we can change this to um, I don't know uh, let's call it something other than my iMac maybe hello Okay, welcome text, we're going to put welcome back, how are you today, then host info, we can change it to any of this stuff, build number, date and time, host name, IP address, network account status, serial number, system version, let's put it on date and time. And then, of course, we can change the background. I'm just going to use one of the default Apple backgrounds, this abstract 2. I'll just drag that in there, and we're good to go. Then we can apply these changes. It wants me to type in my password. Uh, all right. Type it again, apparently. All right. I must have clicked it twice. So, since I can't record while I'm logged out, I'm going to record on my cell phone as I log out. So, I'll go ahead and log out right now. I'll quit Ravisant. Uh, I, I don't really want to save this. And then I can log out. Alright, so here we go. Um, as you can see, the background's changed. My avatar is there. It says hello. Um, the date and time is there, but it's kind of um, blurry uh, just because of the light color. It's not really blurry, but on my cell phone it is. Um, then we have the welcome back. How are you today? So we're all good. Um, but that's just about it, guys. As you see, this works. I'll put a link in the description. Thanks for watching. Bye.